Hello Internet people! In this video I'll show you how to renew your Let's Encrypt SSL certificate in cPanel and I'll be using Zero SSL online tool. I won't show you how to do it automatically as there are no tools that can achieve this online. Unless you have mad skills with Terminal, then you can use CertBot. If you dare to try it, there are a few suggested videos I have in the description, check them out. Otherwise, let's do it. Tip sweat punch. All right. For this tutorial, you'll need account key, CSR, and a domain key. You should have these since you already made the certificate once. If you don't have these, check out my previous video in the description. You're basically requesting new certificate and you have to do it from scratch. So if we go to zerossl.com and go to the tools, and start the SSL certificate wizard. Now, if you're like me and you have your CSR already, just go open up that text file and copy paste the certificate and put it in in the right hand text field. And the same thing you have to do with your account key. So you copy paste it to this field and then just tick these boxes and hit next. So this process will be quick. It just loads it and you'll get the files immediately. Now just download these two. These are the files you're going to place on your server. Servers make internet work. Log into your account and go to your cPanel. I'm going to click on the file manager. Then I'm going to find the domain that I'm going to update right now. In this case, it's bfidiblog.com and I already have the folder structure here for well-known and Ahmed challenge. All you need to do is upload those two files we just downloaded like this. So first and then the second one. All right, once that's done, you can test that this works by clicking the links in zero SSL. If you see this text and number gibberish, then it's all good. <laughs> From lapse to four wins. So now you can hit next in zero SSL. Download your CRT just in case. And go to your cPanel. And if you scroll down, find SSL slash TLS and click on that and manage SSL sites. And here below, make sure it's the domain that you need to update. Then add the CRT, which we just downloaded. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna grab all of this, copy paste it. And then there's two in one. So there's the CRT and the authority bundle. So I'm going to grab the second part. You can see that they're separated by this beginning of certificate and end of certificate tags. And then copy pasted it in the last form. And now I'm just going to open up the domain key, paste it into, into the second text field. And once everything is done, you'll see three check marks next to the text areas. Then you can hit install certificate. And if everything goes well, as again, green check marks, just hit OK. And you're done. Now, don't forget to add a reminder that you have to renew this in 90 days. If you don't do this, your website will turn into zombie kid. I like turtles. Who doesn't, zombie kid? Who doesn't? So just to show you that I'm not tricking you. So now if we go to the website, you'll see that you have the green padlock and that the website is secure. And now you can continue with your day. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the subscribe button and leave a comment down below if you have any questions. And here's a few videos that you might enjoy.